Hey everybody, Rick Needham, handicapping the thoroughbred race, and that's Friday afternoon, February the 18th, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle East Coast Racing Report. Let's go to the feature at Aqueduct Race 8, 3.44 p.m. Eastern Post Time. This is the Undaunted Metal Stakes, 8.3 furlongs, that's a mile and 70 yards on Aqueduct's winterized inner dirt track, three year olds racing for $60,000. Contenders number six, Sky Music. Number one, Gold Raptor. Number four, Eminent Tail. And number three, Ram. Number six, Sky Music has hit the board in power run fashion at three of his four career starts to date, including back to back wins in the first two races of his young career. Number one, Gold Raptor, a four to one shot, is the speed and pace profile leader in this stakes field, racing at or about today's distance of a mile 70 yards on the dirt, has hit the board in power run fashion in three of his respective four outings, winning twice in this recent streak of racing consistency. Race 8 summary, number 6, Sky Music, tops my contenders list, which also includes number 1, Gold Raptor, number 4, Eminent Tail, and number 3, Ram, 6143 in the 8 from Aqueduct, the $60,000 undaunted metal stakes. Go to South Florida's Gulfstream Park for race 2, 1.29 p.m. Eastern Post Time. It's a mile test on their dirt track. Phillies and mares, four years old and up, racing for a claiming purse of $15,000. Contenders number two, Pat's Kitten. Number nine, A Fleet Breeze. Number seven, Jardinia. And number six, Play on Words. Number two, Pat's Kitten is a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony qualifier as both the overall speed and pace profile leader in this claiming field. Racing at the mile distance on the dirt has hit the board in power run fashion in two of her three career starts to date, including a power run win to break her maiden in her second race back. Number nine, a fleet breeze, four to one in the morning line, turned in power run performances in five straight, hitting the board in three of those adventures, including a power run win to break her maiden in her fourth race back. Race number two summary, two, Pat's Kitten, tops my contenders list, which also includes number nine, a fleet breeze, number seven, Jardinia, and number six, play on words, two nine, seven six in the second from Gulfstream Park. Bonus long shots, Hawthorne, race two, the four to one shot, number three, double fever, qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony, takes a class drop of 13 units, decent overall speed for this six furlong sprint. Turf Paradise, race four, the four to one shot, number two, County Kildare, takes a slight class drop, is the speed leader in this claiming field, sprinting at this afternoon's distance of six furlongs on the dirt. So handicapping from both Aqueduct and Gulfstream Park on a Friday afternoon. Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.